Okay, it is late August, and I am just going to show off briefly my first attempt at a terrace on this hillside. This is a steep hillside. You can kind of see the slope over here. It's about 16 degree slope, most of the places I measure it. And the idea is to put this rock wall in all through here, and then the soil will build up and level off eventually. I'm not going to truck in soil. I'm going to compost in place, put in scraps of wood, uh, leaves, and uh, plants, and compost everything in place to hopefully have very rich soil. So I'll show you real quick what we're doing. This is what it looks like from the back. Not quite as pretty, but building up to the peak where hopefully it will be sturdy enough to hold back the dirt. This takes a lot of time, a lot of effort. Oh man, a lot of effort uh, to move these rocks from somewhere else. We grow a really good crop of rocks every year in Missouri, and I thought this would be an excellent way to put them to use. This is about, let's see, somewhere between 18 to 20 feet, uh, depending on where you want to stop here. This rock, oh man, more than I could pick up just about. I got it over here, but it just about killed me to get it there. Uh, a lot of these take two hands. Uh, some of them only take one hand, but looking at what uh, stone fences look like and stone terraces look like in New England whenever it was being done uh, hundreds of years ago, this is fairly similar to what it looked like. They usually had more big rocks, but they also had more time and were getting paid to do it. I'm doing this after work. So, you can see over there what eventually is going to hopefully happen is the hillside will come out and then drop off. Drop off at the ledge. I'm going to do some more underneath here. Go out, drop off. Go out, drop off. I'm making biochar over there. That's what that smoke is. But that will hopefully slow the rain from just running down the hill. Slow it, soak in, and then make it a little more drought resistant here. Um, how I'm doing this is putting the wall behind my fruit tree rows. Here's a straight line. There's a, a persimmon tree. There's another persimmon tree there. You can see the persimmon trees through here a little bit easier. And so the line will go behind the runs of fruit trees going down to the greenhouse for a ways. I might eventually put beds on this, but boy, that is a lot of a lot of work, a lot of beds to get built between here and down there where I'm working on my newest run of beds. So this is step one. Uh, I'm going to go about another 20, 25 foot to where that stake is at with the string and hopefully eventually work on stone steps up to this point uh, that I could be able to uh, go up and down, hopefully with a wheelbarrow, but we'll see how that goes. So, stage one of making an old-fashioned field rock terrace. 